below me. I can't just oppose work on them just like that unless the instruction comes from above. Yes, I know. You know, they can't understand you the way I do understand you. They 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 feel like you're actually the one giving them the jobs and the works yourself. But I I think I have an idea. We should idea. go together to the party. What do you think? Angela, and um, you think that will work? <clears throat> yeah, hello, engineer. I've been waiting for your response since, but I've not heard from you. What's happening? You should have told me since, man. You kept quiet. It is, it is abnormal. All right. Okay. Okay. No problem. I'll be waiting. Hey, friend. Angela. Oh, my God. Is this you? Yes. This is me. Wow. Honestly, you're not looking bad. Mm, you're not looking bad either. Mm -hmm. How have you been? It's oh. been a while. Just look at me. I'm okay. Wow. Happy ages. How's life with you? Hmm. It's it's really been not really been good anyway. You wow. know, I have to like do some one or two, three jobs to pay my bills, you know, take care of myself. You know, all those stuff now, so it's really been difficult. But I actually came to see a friend around this vicinity and I was like, why not check up on Fred? Wow. <laughs> so I decided to say hello. Oh, that's very, that's so nice of you. That's okay, you have not checked yet. <laughs> anyway, I am so sorry about your, you know, about your condition. But, you know, sometimes life is tough. Yeah, life is really tough. Wow. Oh. Um, Angela. I think I have an idea. Uh, about what? Yeah. Why don't you... I mean, I want you to come and work in my office as my personal secretary. How about that? No. No. Fred, you, you're just... You're joking. Come right? on, I'm not joking. I'm serious. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, come thank on. you so much. I'm so happy. But... Uh, what is it? There's a little problem. Okay, and what could I do? Come on, talk to me. You know, where I stay is actually very far from here. And I won't be able to live there to come to work here. It's going to be very, very, very far. So Angela, listen, that will not be an issue. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, how about you staying with me? Yes, stay with me until you, you get enough money to rent an apartment of your choice. Then, you can enter your apartment. How about that? That's actually a good idea. Oh my God, I can't believe you're actually saying this to me. Oh, come on. Thank you so much. You don't know how much this job means to me. I'm so happy. And I will not disappoint you. I promise. Mm. Angela, you're talking as if you don't know me. <laughs> And I know you for long. I know your skills. I know what you're capable of doing. Mm -hmm. Okay? I'll be so glad that you work with us in our company. Okay, right now I'm shy. I'm mm -hmm. now. You don't know, need to be shy because <laughs> you know you know your words, you know, that's why. Okay, you know, thank you so I'm so happy I'm so happy you're here now. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I will not disappoint you. I trust you and I believe you. Okay, okay. I have to go now. All right. All right. Hope you're okay, right? Okay. So, I'm so happy I'll come tomorrow. Without wasting time. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Fred. Come on. I'll be expecting you. All right. Say hello to Daniel to me. Yeah, I will. I will. Bye. Bye. Wow. Angela. Very nice girl. Hmm. Hello, Ifora.
Yes, come in. Hey, Fred. Hey, Angela, how are you? Going home already. Home? Yes. <laughs> come on, I didn't plan leaving earlier. What's going on? So you're not coming for the party? Party? The office party. Office party? I had no idea. I mean, we're having a party. Everyone is invited. I mean, why aren't you going to be there? Office party? Honestly, Angela, I, 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 I had no idea of any office party. I mean, why would they invite me? I'm their boss and I'm supposed to be present. Yes, normally you're supposed to be present. But let's see. You know, I noticed something. They don't really like you. And I've been hearing them chit chat, you know, gossiping here and there. They feel you're so strict and, you know, you're too hard on them. You give them a lot of jobs and all of that, a lot of work. But Angela, you know me. I can't just oppose work on them just like that unless the instruction comes from above. Yes, I know. You know, they can't understand you the way I do understand you. They, they, they feel like you're actually the one giving them the jobs and the works yourself. But I... I think I have an idea. We should idea. go together to the party. What do you think? Angela, and um, you think that will work? It will work. See what will happen. You and I would go together to the party and we get to see the front side of you. You know, show them the other side of you, the one I know. Be playful and they'll get to like you. Hmm. Angela, I think you're right there. I'm always right. <laughs> Angela, <laughs> I am so happy to have you by my side. Mm. Same here. Thank you for always being faithful to me. You're welcome. Okay. Um, in that case, let's go and get ready. No, you should get ready because I am ready. You are ready too. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me get ready. We'll go together. Okay, I'm waiting oh. for you. Once you're just done, just, you know. Yeah. Come to my office. I'll be waiting. Okay, just give me a minute. All right. I'll be right there with you. What? I'm trying to... I have to try my best to, you know, carry everybody along. Well, they hate me. I never hate them. I never oppose work on them. Hardly. You know, I'm trying being straightforward as your boss. I'm not wicked. Why wouldn't they just understand me? Angela. Yeah. Sorry for keeping you waiting. No, it's okay. okay. I'm almost done analyzing the Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright. So how is it? It's okay. Alright. Hmm. Wonderful. Angela. You're wonderful in shorts. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome, dear. Yeah. Oh, um, that reminds me. Angela. Yes. Um, now that I have attended the party and I have seen the kind of boss I am, how do they feel now about me? I hope they must have liked me now. <laughs> Honestly speaking, you know, you can't just please humans. They are actually saying, um, they're actually seeing you as a very soft person right now. They are mocking you, they're even laughing at you. <laughs> I don't even know why. <laughs> mocking me uh, and laughing at me, too. <laughs> but, but why? I don't understand. At least I attended the party, I, I, I bought drinks, I even played game with them. So, why would they? You know, they've actually seen the. Childish out of you, so 
they're like making jest of you and they've been laughing at you. You know, you know how people can be anyway. You can never please them. <laughs> this is what, what would I go? So okay now, what do you suggest I should do? You know, I was actually surprised myself. And come to think come to think of it, I was just like, you can never please human beings. So I would advise you to just be who you are. Live your life. Do not live your life to please others, you know. As long as you know that you're not doing something bad. Yeah. You're being true to yourself. So just live your life. Whatever you do, they must talk. I'm not asking you to be strict. I'm just saying like, you know, do the right thing at the right time when you feel it is the right time. Do not do it because you want to impress other people. Because in this world, whatever you do, people will talk. So just be you. I think you're right, Angela. At least I'm trying my best to make sure everybody's happy. But since they are not happy as well, then I have to be who I am. Yes, Fred. You have to be who you are. Not for anybody. Just be yourself. They will learn. <laughs> it's okay. Okay, I have to go to my office now. I still have other... Uh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I understand, Angela. Thank you so much once again. You're welcome. Right. Don't think about it too much. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> so, in this world, whatever you do, people must talk. You can never please everyone. Then I choose to be who I am. In fact, it was so hectic. I see. That, that party, Fred was like, okay, uh, we want to make a toast. You know, he likes beer. He likes beer a lot. And you know, as he was about to make the toast, the drink just came out from his nose. I can't believe you are working for a I'm telling you. Fred, see, actually, I was going to. Oh, Fred, what's up? What is here? What are you people doing here? Instead of you working in the office. Why you know we have a lot of work in your desk? And you people are out here laughing and gissing. What's the meaning of that? We're only trying to take a break. You're take a break? By what time? Is it the time of break? God, sir, it's, I think it's almost time for break. And we decided to take it ahead. Listen, let's, listen and listen good, both of you. You see, this weekend, you both, you two, are going to work out of time. Yes. Just can you imagine? This is not a time of break. You're telling me you, you, you have a break. Who gave you the break? Sorry. Sorry. I think this is the time I will do the right thing. I've tried a lot to please everybody in this company. But I can see that you people are not taking the correction. Now, you should go back to the work. Yes, sir. Okay. What nonsense. I've been trying to please everybody, but since you people want to take the correction, I think I have to do what is right. <laughs> 